welcome back. In this next video, we are going to, it's going to be very similar to the house payments. It's all the same concepts, but I just want to show you something to use for car payments. Okay, so going back to our worksheet. <clears throat> um, so our friend Tito is ready to buy his first car. And Tito has not saved a down payment, so he's going to finance the entire purchase. He's found the car he wants, and he's negotiated a price of $18,000 for the car. Um, because he has not had a chance to establish credit, right, and this happens a lot when you're young, um, you ha haven't gotten credit cards or gotten any sort of loans, he has a low credit score, okay? That just happens when you're young. Um, on his own, he can get a loan with an annual interest rate of 5%. If he gets his abuela to co-sign the loan, then he can get an annual interest rate of 3.5%. But he's really hoping to buy this first car on his own. So let's see what the difference is going to be on his payments. And um, it's going to be a five-year loan or 60 monthly payments, okay? Um, so we're going to calculate two ways. We're going to do if he does the loan himself or if he gets his abuela to co-sign and see if the payment amount is different enough um, for, for Tito to get that. And she's willing to co-sign. He just really wants to do it on his own, which I totally understand. Um, okay, so the car price is $18,000. Either way, $180,000. He's not buying a Lamborghini. I don't even know if those cost $180,000. All right, his down payment is zero. But I left it in here just in case anybody wanted to use this in the future. So the amount of the loan is just going to be uh, the purchase price minus the down payment, $18,000. That doesn't change. All right. So the annual interest rate is 5% if he does it on his own and 3.5% if he does it with his abuela. Um, his monthly interest rate then is going to be our annual interest rate divided by 12. And the loan term in months, we said, is going to be 60 monthly payments. We didn't know the 60, but we knew the five years, then we could just do five times 60. So we'll just copy this. And you can see it calculates. So the monthly interest rate for the Abuela loan is slightly less. All right, so as monthly payment, it's going to be the exact same thing we did for the house. It's going to be formula, financial, payment. The rate is the monthly interest rate. The number of periods is the monthly number of monthly payments, which is 60. And the amount of the loan is 18000 So on his own, Tito's going to pay $339.68 um, for his loan. If I just copy and paste this over, it'll use all my new numbers because I use formulas. And um, his payment would go down if he had his abuela co-signed to $327.45. But now that Tito has this information, he can decide, is it worth the extra 12, <coughs> saving uh, $12 a month um, to get his abuela to co-sign? Or is it worth $12 a month to him to be able to say, I bought my first car on my own? And that is going to be his choice. But at least now he has the information to make that choice. So that is the car loans. Um, those are the only two we're going to do on payments. And the next two examples, we are going to look at imputing an interest rate. So we understand the real cost um, involved in borrowing some money. All right. I will see you.